Hey guys, hey everyone, how are y'all doing out there? It's a girl Twin D. Welcome to the camp if you're new here. My longtime subscribers, you already know the drill. Big up on yourself, enough respect, and thank you all for the continuous support. I'm so happy to be back. Like I wasn't okay. <laughs> I wasn't okay for a while. Oh my gosh. And this three job thing. Mm -mm. No, 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 no. It ain't working. It ain't working. It ain't working. But I'm happy to get some time that I could make some videos and then post them so you guys can have them. Right? Anyways, let's see what this message is going to be about. And thank you again for your support. Let's jump into your message. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thine will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. All right, guys. Let's see how your divine masculines are feeling. Yeah, that's what we want to know today. So what's going on with our divine masculines, Father God? How are they feeling? How are our masculines feeling today whenever we are watching this message? What's going on with them? Oh, they feel good. I guess they're feeling happy right now. They're feeling in their power. They're, they're feeling like that child again. That's the energy we want them in. That's the energy we want them to make sure that they hold on to. Because nothing feels better than when you love yourself. Than when you are truly happy. Some of your divine masculines are feeling that energy of reconciliation. Starting over. Oh Jesus. They still have this huh? Some of your divine masculine still have this energy in that player energy. And of course, we are all at different stages on this twin flame journey. So yes, of course, of course, some are going to be in this player energy. And I, I did another video where it, I think the title was that is their immature attitude that kept them from you. However it is, I don't remember. I don't know which day I'm going to post it, but it's going to be there so you can take a look at it. But some of your divine masculines are in that player energy right now. True love. <laughs> wow, they're experiencing true love. They're feeling that true love. Lo oh, look, loves you but hiding it. So they're experiencing that love. They're feeling that love. They know what that love is. Well, they don't know, but they know that love is for you, right? And nobody else. No wonder they're feeling happy at this beginning. But some of them, they still have that block, will not commit. Yeah. And that's because of other things, underlining things. Let's see what else and how they're feeling here. Yeah. Ending, heartbreak, and loss. So some of your divine masculines are going through endings right now. And they're experiencing that heartbreak. And that is the reason why, yes, again... They're scared of committing because they have been through that. Yeah, and we've all been through it. We've all been through it. But we understand it more because we are the awakened ones, right? They don't. So, mm, rich little things. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Some of you guys may have a chance meeting with your person. Or with somebody else. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. Ace of Cups, baby. Oh, my gosh. And I told you. See, the judgment card came back around. That second chance. That reconciliation. That's where that chance meeting is coming in. So this person may be coming in with an offer here. It's like their heart is overflowing with love. I told you they're feeling this love. And they know it's for you and from you. Nobody else, baby. The Ace of Cups and the Sun. Like, what more do you want? <laughs> I mean, some action would be good. <laughs> but that's where our trust and faith comes in. Because the action will be taken. It will. It will. We will all fulfill our missions. The Hierophant. 
yeah so this person is definitely looking forward to commitment this person is definitely uh, me also definitely <laughs> trying to overcome belief systems and religion and now uh, tradition and some of them are also in committed situation that they're trying to get out of and they're thinking about these things but most importantly they're feeling this committed situation with you 525 this person will return all right they will return so they gotta overcome all these challenges before they return and it's something they have to do, guys. Oh, Jesus. Why, why, why? Let me go get that. Okay, so there it is. Obstacles. The, the, the obstacles they need to overcome. Just like I was saying. Need to make a choice. Some of them, yeah, they know they're sitting in a situation that they shouldn't be in. Because, again, they can feel that love and nobody can, you know, love. That's why you got to have a strong control over love over your emotions. Because love will lead you astray, yeah, right? Love will cause you to do stupid things, right? Love will cause you to do ungodly things, right? So you got to have control over your life, over yourself, over your emotions. But now they're realizing, not realizing they know they need to make a choice. Because all these interferences is going to make them settle for something that doesn't make them happy. Look no you're wasting your time yeah they know they feel it they feel it i'm just wasting my time here yeah the addictions everything toxic behaviors and like i said some of them are in toxic relationship look what came back around so something is happening with these divine masculines and their emotion is taking over it's taking over it's taking over <laughs> new beginnings <laughs> New beginnings, too much drama, not interested. We ain't interested in these toxic behavior, people, places, things, animals, whatever it is. No, we ain't interested. 717, man, this number just keeps coming around. Page of Cups, there's an offer coming in from this person. There's an offer, a small offer, and it's going to move up to that big offer. There's an offer of love that's going to be extended to you, Divine Feminine. Oh, soulmate, Jesus of mercy. So, okay. So, as I'm getting, right, let me let me tell you as I'm getting. For some of you guys, this may be a soulmate that's extending that offer. This may be a soulmate that you are having this new beginning with. And like I always tell you guys, 747, not that, but what's coming next? <laughs> like I always tell you, if a soulmate enters your life, if you're going to be with that soulmate, it shouldn't be because I'm fed up of my masculine or I can't stand my masculine or, I'm, or my masculine is not moving forward. So I'm going to choose somebody else. It shouldn't be because of that. Because soulmates aren't meant to stay in your life. Forever. And since you're a twin flame, if you're a true twin flame, it's going to be very difficult. But there is a higher level soulmate that's just like. A twin flame. I don't know how God is going to work that one out. But you know. I don't know how it works. I need to have a discussion on this. One day. I don't know how it works. I'm just going with the flow. I'm just learning as I go. So I can teach you. But. This is the reason why you need to be in that place. Where the decisions you're making is for you. You're happy. You're not thinking about the masculine. You don't even care where they are. You don't even care if they're coming back. And everything that belongs to you will come. Could even be that soulmate. You don't know. But do not move on to a soulmate just because you're fed up. Do not move on to a soulmate just because the masculine isn't giving you what you want. Wow. Right? You have to be in that energy where you're free. You're not thinking about the masculine. And if the soulmate comes along and there's love there, I don't know. But one thing I know is don't ever move on to a soulmate just because you're fed up and just because you're tired. Do it if you're going to do it. 
and ask God how to guide you. Because only he knows what your purpose is. Only he knows where you need to be in life. Oh, 1010. Jesus, you see what I'm saying? Something's completed. I think I should have said that. Something is completed. Let's get some truth on your message. So again, some of you guys may have this new beginning with a soulmate. Like it said, more than a one night stand. Yep. So something's definitely going to work out for somebody here. Okay, let's see what else. Fighting their feelings for you. We didn't, didn't, we, didn't we, we get that already? Loves you but hiding it. Yeah, they're fighting their feelings. Why worry when you can pray? There you go. So pray about the situation, guys. Making discoveries and things come into light. <laughs> That's the discovery that they're making. That's what's causing them to move forward here and break free from that, those traditional things. Just passion, not long term. Th That's the player energy I'm getting right there. Researching the connection. Thinking or dreaming of you. Your connection is moving to the next level. Well, we did see that big old ace of cups and that sun, right? So you are moving to the next level. But anyways, guys, this has been your message. I love you all. Let go and let God. And I'll see you at your next message. If you would like to purchase a reading, go to my website, twindflamed.square.site. I think from that website, there are links that can take you to all my other websites. And guys, don't forget to check out my bath and body products, guys. I do have, what, what's this? <laughs> I do have, these, these are lip scrubs and winter is coming in, guys. We, we are going to need it. We're going to need it. So I'm making new products. I haven't put these on the website as yet. But they are coming and I do have um, mini sizes coming in. And of course, your um, body scrubs and everything. Because again, I'm here to take care of the mind, body and soul. So go to my website guys. TwinDFlameD.Square.Site And my Bath and Body website is DianesBathAndBody.Square.Site Love you all. Like one like God and I'll see you in the next message later. Love you all.